What's going on guys? Chamber 1000 and welcome back to another episode of Luigi's Mansion. Now, I am starting the recording here because uh, in my test recording, if you remember, there was a gold bar that didn't appear even though I opened this. I, I oh, yeah. went back and there was a gold bar in it. I don't know why because in my last recording, I swear I was... I tapped on this during when the ghosts were still around, but it didn't appear. It was strange. So, th there is a gold bar. I just got it. I don't know why it didn't appear before. Anyways, yeah. Uh, I got a few uh, coins and cash, too, while I was out exploring. Oh, a heart. Alright. Uh, well, I'm full, anyway. Anyways, though. Yeah. Last time, we defeated good old Neville. 42-year-old uh, Neville spends his afterlife reading all the books in... Uh, he missed while living. But yeah. Uh, anyways. We got a key from him. That leads to a door at the end of the hall. Let's see where that goes to. I'm um, also gonna suck up some of the ghosts in the hallway. So I don't actually step on them. Sometimes you might run into it. Uh, and it can like damage you for no reason. I mean, well, not really no reason. Just run into it. It takes damage. But it's like a waste kind of to lose damage that way. So it's good to... Sometimes, like, just, uh, use your vacuum while going through the hallway. Anyway, this here is... Alright, the, the boss ghost here is Lydia. Isn't my hair just gorgeous? Of course. I do spend a lot of time on it. I was so bored cooped up in that painting. Now, I spend all my time in front of the mirror. It seems to scare people, though. So everything is coming up roses. Alright, anyways. Uh, yeah. So, uh, let's see what secrets we can find around here. Oh, I remember you hold this fan. It takes a while, actually, to get this fan spinning. You don't go in a circle like you do with the chandeliers, but you just hold down and you get a bunch of cash out of it. Alright, anyways, let's see what other areas... Oh! Another... Wait, that was in my test recording. Okay, well, uh, that's pretty lucky, I guess. Uh, anyways, uh, I did not expect to find another gold bar. Oh, money! Yeah, let's do this. All right, anyways, let me do that. And that, and... Then we got a bit of a draft that she does not like, apparently. Come on. Holy crap, it did one go. I can't believe I actually did that. Holy crap, we got a big pearl. Nice. All right, now let's see where this goes. Uh, no, nope. doesn't go to Mario. It's uh, <laughs> here you go. Yeah, we got another key. Goes to that room, huh? Yeah, this was the master bedroom. Now, if we turn pull up Z or the items, did we go to Lydia? Now, if you notice, Neville is 42 years old, and uh, Lydia. He's only 34. Kind of nuts. I mean, they're dead now, so I guess that doesn't matter, but... Kind of like the gauge cap, I guess. I don't know. Anyways, Lydia. She stashed her secret savings away to prepare for her afterlife. Uh, hmm. Uh, well, sorry about that. I already took it all. <laughs> yeah, she's uh, the mirror-gazing mother. Anyways. Yeah, you see toads out here. Um... Yeah. Also, I tried uh, one time um, doing the moon, but all it does is do the window. And Luigi says, I just can't stand the sight of broken things. Anyways, uh, let's go back, shall we? Let's go to the next room. Hmm? Creepy. Anyways, oh, uh, I'm just gonna. Yeah, all right. Uh, let's do this. This is this room is gonna have what's called an area boss. 
it means it's the last boss of the area, and it will give you a key to the next area, usually. Alright, now, this has a heart that fills you up all the way, I'm pretty sure, so I'm not going to open that, since we're already at full health, and it'd be a waste. If we do this, pretty sure... If you look really closely, you can tell it's just really just full graph. Right. Also, I found this really funny. If you go to the uh, pictures over here, Luigi says, now that's just not my style. <laughs> All right. Anyways, uh, yeah. Oh, you got a heart here. I didn't realize that. All right. Anyways, uh, there. if you highlight this, thing around the coins. I think I used to have one of these. Yeah, I did. Now, if you go uh, this uh, heart over here. Horsey. Rocky. Horsey. Yeah, Alright. Anyways. It's kind of telling you to rock the horse with your vacuum. Alright. So, let's do as it says, I guess. And the door is closed with spikes. Hey, wanna play with me? Uh, and then he shoots these bears at you. Okay, now, this is something I, okay. I have the thing I would say about this game. Legit, Nintendo makes you, so, you're getting attacked, but in self-defense, what you're supposed to do is get this ball and you shoot it at his face. Nintendo is making you shoot a ball at a child's face. Like, that is so screwed up. Why? Oh my god, anyways, let's see what he says. Ow, you gave me an owie. I just wanted to play with you. I hate grown-ups. Why do you have to be bigger than me? I've had enough. Small, now grow smaller. Small, inty, tiny, little, wee, ga, ga, goo, goo, ga. And now we're inside his crib. We're a very tiny Luigi. It's like he gave us a poison mushroom without the effects of it damaging us. And it lasts for the whole boss battle. Alright. This is Chauncey, the Area 1 boss. Yeah. Ding. <laughs> yeah, that ding at the end there was really hilarious. Alright, anyways. First up, he's gonna throw these rocking horses at you. You wanna just run past him. Alright, there's two. Next. He's gonna throw the ball that you hit at him. Just dodge him until there's one that stays on the ground. Like over here. Oh! That was my fault. Uh. Yeah, also, the boss battle or area bosses are different than the normal ones where you get the portraits. Instead of doing a one go, it's actually impossible to do that, so you just gotta kind of, um. Try doing it without taking much damage. Now try not to miss. All right, there. Come on. Oh my God, he's stuck. Wait, did I just get a soft lock? Oh. Oh, soft. Okay, yeah, that's good. Yeah, usually if you you'll take damage if you're on him for too long, I think. Then he does a spelly flop thing that you kind of just avoid. Yeah, if I could do this without taking damage, that'd be pretty cool. I took some damage last one. I got a silver in my practice run, but let's see if I can do better in this one. Alright. Come on. Can I call him Mario? So, Oh, uh, I just realized I can't call him Mario during this fight. That's hilarious. I didn't know that. Oh. Yeah, this boss battle is um, crazy how it makes you throw a ball at him.
All right, stop. Oh, you don't take damage? Oh, that's interesting. All right. Oh, come on, avoid him. Yeah, the next one should be it. If I can actually do this, get a gold on him, that'd be pretty amazing. You got a silver on Neville, but I got a gold on Lydia. If I can get a gold on this one, that'd be really cool. All right. Here comes the balls. Just gotta avoid him. And oh, 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 oh. Okay, go, 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 go. Come on, go, go, go. Holy crap, I did it. I really hope that was the gold I got. That'd be amazing if I did. All right. Wow, he did it. Also, can you actually? I'm curious. You can let you go out of the room. <laughs> okay. I can let you. Okay. Uh, that's hilarious. Anyways, I didn't actually know you could leave or something. I thought I would have to make you. Uh, oh, hold on. I missed the room. All right. Anyways. Yeah, there's a hundred heart here, but I'm not gonna worry about that. Uh, did we get this? I forget if we did. Oh, we didn't. Okay. I'll take that, I guess. Anything else here? I don't know if there's a reward or anything, but I was just curious. I guess not. What about... Hmm, no. Okay, anyways, let's open up this chest. Dun, 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 dun. I love that soundtrack. Oh, oh, we're getting an incoming call from Egad. All right, let's see what's up. Luigi, can you hear me? Oh, thank goodness you're okay. I lost contact with you all of a sudden. I was a tad worried. Hmm, you seem to be a bit tuckered out after that long battle, don't you? Why don't you come on back to the lab? When you vacuum a boss ghost, your Poltergeist 3000 gets pretty much full of bursting to bursting. But, ho oh, ho, I guess you showed that boss ghost who's boss! Oh man, that was such a good fun for you, Ed. Dude. <laughs> I love it when Nintendo. Uh, has game game characters do really bad puns like that? Oh god, it's hilarious. Okay, this is one of the reasons I always like Chuck Conroy because of his bad jokes of puns making. But yeah, <laughs> good job, Luigi. You made it back in one piece. Take a gander at this. This fine piece of work took nearly 20 years to develop. I call it the Ghost. Portificationizer. This machine lets us turn the ghosts you catch into paintings. Not only that, it works in reverse too. Hmm? Well, how do we use it? You ask. Well, it's simple. Just plug that Poltergeist 2000 into the slot and enjoy the ride, my boy. Ghosts are invisible, so we need to press them into visible forms. Press and presto, turn them into beautiful ghost before paintings. Hmm. Well, we managed to turn those ghosts back into paintings thanks to your help, Luigi. And here are the results. Of every one. Silver on Neville, gold on Lydia, and gold on Chauncey. Oh boy, that was pretty cool. It's too bad we didn't get a gold on Neville, but eh, it's fine. Alright, you got a total of three ghosts. Alright, this is all the money we've earned.
Wow. That's a... Okay, the total is a little short from the um, other file, the practice recording, but not bad. Yeah, it's pretty good. All right. It's like a H or G rank, I think, right now. If you don't know what I'm talking about, at the end of the game, depending on how much gold you have by the end of it, you can um, get a little secret at the end of it. Like, a, uh, after the mansion is gone, you get enough money to... All the money's real, so you could use it to uh, make yourself a, a mansion of your own. And that's what it's going to be used for. Anyways, so, let's see. Uh, oh, alright, save. Here we go. Uh, let's go back to the mansion. We still have a little time before when I'm recording. Alright, uh, now, if you notice, this door is glowing with spikes. You can't usually access it, but if you go up to it... Now that we have the area boss key, it will open. Alright. Also, if you go to the boss menu, you can see Chauncey here. The spoiled baby Chauncey, one year old. He cries loudly and never sleeps through the night. But since he was born a ghost, this seems natural. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, yeah. Anyway, so yeah, that'll be it for this recording. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm going to save the next area for, well, next time. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you enjoyed, make sure to definitely subscribe to my YouTube channel, follow me on Twitter, and join my Discord. But next time, we'll be going to Area 2, exploring uh, this whole area, I guess. Wow, there's a lot to explore in this other area, if you look at it. God, it's pretty big. <laughs> it's going to probably take a while till we search this whole place. Anyways, that'll be it for this video. So, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time.